Last work and three tap all resills again, thanks to a damage buff that recently happened in Into the Light. It was a 6% damage increase. So I figured I'd do a video talking about the gun since I've done so many videos on it recently and I hadn't done one since that original checkmate change got implemented and it couldn't three tap. So it does 81 damage now. So it even has a range cushion for its three tap, which is really cool. Its body shot damage is still very unforgiving, but that's fine. That's the trade off the guns always deserved. And it's really nothing new for the weapon. The issue I have is that it lost its main pairing, which is sniper rifles. You really can't use sniper rifles in this new sandbox. The, their ammo economy is horrible. And I, I just got to say this. This is a quick aside here from the main co uh, topic. I do not like these special ammo changes they're doing. I didn't really have much of a problem with the original start with two ammo and pick up bricks system that we had. I think the main issue I had was all the Zimmers that were taking advantage of it, and I do not like the way they're going about solving it. I think the weird special ammo crate thing they did last weekend was horrible, and I just, I don't get what's going on with them. They seem really indecisive with what system to go forward with, and I just like them to settle down and stop making terrible decisions. But back to last word, you can't use it with a sniper, due to the reasons that I just said. It, they don't have enough ammo, they're not worth it. You also don't want to use it with close quarters weapons because then they're just kind of overlapping. You're using two close quarters weapons at the same time. That's never been the best loadout in the world to use. So the best pairing I found was Igneous Hammer. And in this case, you get to take advantage of Lucky Pants for both weapons, which is awesome. Igneous Hammer is basically your sniper rifle in this case. You can proc Radiant with it, and then you can hot swap to last word and kill people in close quarters with a damage buff. That's the best way to use this thing. I'll drop the full dim link in the description as well. And outside of that, I really don't know what else you'd use it for. Because the main issue with the gun, and this has always been the issue with the gun, even back when it was really good, when people get too close to you, the gun kind of sucks. It's very hard to hit shots with when someone gets within like 15 meters of you. So you really want to keep them within a 15 to 20 meter range window. And anything outside of that starts to really fall off as far as your effectiveness goes. And that's the main issue I have with the gun all along. You, you get limited to maneuvering yourself into certain spots just so you can get one kill. Where if you were just using a different gun, you could have got that same kill from a different spot, more likely a safer spot, and then continued on to fight other people with a larger magazine that this thing does not have. It has eight rounds in the mag. You get one chance to fight one person, basically. And if you fail, you're dead. If you succeed, you're going to die very soon if someone else is attacking you. That's the way this gun currently works. It's a dueling weapon. In a sandbox where no thing, nothing else is a dueling weapon in this game. All the other weapons are 40 round mag autos, 12 round hand cannons. Like it's just, why would you use this thing? So in my opinion, I think it deserves some type of ADS buff where it can get a little bit more range, a little bit more mileage out of its ADS to then switch to hit fire when you want to kill fast up close. That would be the most ideal form of this weapon. And it's not the form it's currently in. It's hit fire only basically in a range window that really is just not worth fighting in. Everyone's playing pretty passive right now with their primary, so trying to force people into that range distance is gonna take a long time and you're only gonna get one kill as a result of it and then you're gonna die. That's really the last word gameplay loop as, at the moment. But I don't wanna ramble on for too long because I'm sure if they're gonna make changes to the gun, they'll make them soon. And if they're not, they're not. So I'm just gonna give up on the weapon at this point and hope and we'll transition to the gameplay now, enjoy. This is exactly what I wanted. Joining late on multiplex. Perfect. Let's freaking go. Let's have some fun. Oh, cool. And he's using a grenade launcher. Let's freaking go, man. It's about to be so much fun. And he's using mountain topic loose. I don't know how to fight people that try and engage in a gunfight like that. He was just standing there and threw a shuriken at me not prepared for that level of trickery. Ah, uh, he flinched me off that shot. It's unfortunate. He's in this down here somewhere in some annoying position. How long are we gonna do this for, dude? Okay. That's it for. Oh, I didn't heal up enough. Lucky, 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 lucky. I'll take. Where's this guy at? The leader. Who is the leader? Ah. 
over here about to clean me up. Okay. Got smoked. I don't know how that guy didn't kill me. There's really no excuse for him. He just absolutely failed. Ugh, bad aim for me too. I'll take that trade 100%. Some fella over here. Oh. That was oblivious. Take that kill. Thank you very much. Uh, definitely a bold peak. I was too good at staying alive and I ended up getting killed by the leader. My hope was that someone else would end up killing me or that they wouldn't get pinched by like the entire lobby, but neither of those things came true. It was just a catastrophe across the board. Couldn't get that kill either. Everyone's got their supers because I joined late. It's just, it's terrible. This is a terrible time. Pretty confident I'm gonna make the comeback though in the end. Why does he have an overshield? What? Okay. I see we're handing out overshields for just about anything now. He's on stasis, so I guess he's running Whisper of Rhyme. Very bizarre choice to run that. On stasis on it. I'm, I'm on it. Oh my god, this guy is an actual choke artist. He's a professional choker. <laughs> a professional choker. That sounds quite weird. But that's what he is. Six more kills. I really don't want to do it with heavy ammo, but I joined late, so I get I get the excuse to use it. I'm just gonna kill this guy with it because this is the good player. Actually, no, the good player's over here. I'm gonna kill him regardless, as well as this guy. Now we send some grenade launcher shots in. Perfect. And I'm gonna shoot out this last one. Out. How did that third shot not hit him when I repeat there? Alright. Just had to cover my flank there. I was not about to get pinched when I had a super. Okay, he's dead. And I got my knife back. Sweet. Uh-oh. Here, hold this. Alright. That's a win. Ew. Yucky, yucky, yucky. I just pooped on that guy at the end. 